So now we're going to do this guy by using expansion by minors. Um, and this will work for all matrices of any square, any square matrix, any size, that'll work. Um, we're going to choose a row or a column to expand across. And you want to choose one with a zero if you can. So I want to expand down that first column. But any one you pick will work. And then there's a, a sign matrix that goes along with this. It, it alternates plus, minus, plus, starting with the pluses in the corners. So hopefully this will make sense in a sec. So I'm going to start with the negative 2. And I'm going to multiply it by his minor. So his minor comes when I cross out his row and his column. What's left is this little thing here, 4, negative 3, 5, negative 1. So that's a little determinant. We'll set them aside. We'll do that later. Move down to the next one, and this will be a minus 0 times his determinant. Now here it doesn't matter because it's going to be 0 anyway, but I'll put it in just so we can see it. Uh, if I cross out his row and his column, I'm left with 3, 1, 5, negative 1. Move down to the last guy, I'll be a positive 2. And if I cross out his row and his column, I'm left with 3, 1, 4, negative 3. So now I have all these little determinants, and I can find those 2 by 2s really easy just by multiplying the diagonals so I have, and subtracting, right? So negative 4 minus a minus 15, so plus 15. This one here is just going to be 0 because it doesn't matter. And then negative 9 minus 4. So now I'm just doing this. So this is uh, negative 2 times 11 plus 2 times negative 13, so that's negative 22 minus 26, so I get a negative 48, which is hopefully what I got last time.